Okay, welcome back. I realized that the last slide also not very well taken because the mobile phone kept focusing as and where I move it. So I also don't know how to overcome that. Uh, sad to say, I'm still learning uh, and I still have to carry on. Uh. So now let's handle another feed that is a bit more challenging. This feed has a basic size of 120 and it's K7-F7. So first, we also do the same thing, we draw the box. And collect the four value, K7, F7. What are the values that we have? I'll just write down the value first and I'll show you how I got it. So the value I got here is plus 10, minus 25, minus 36 and minus 71 okay let's see where I get the value first huh? I'm going to show you the table first let's go for how do I get K, K7 huh? I'm going to put it close to my here and uh, I'll tell the camera to focus please focus yes can you see that it's 120 here? I go all the way and look for K7. I'll stop here. Can you see that? I got plus 10 minus 25. That is, that is here. And how did I get F7? So in this table, I don't get it. I go to the next table. And again, I force it to focus. Huh? I'll tap on my screen. Okay, 120 is here. I go and look for F, F7, I move here, you see, F7, I'll stop here. I've got the number, minus 36, minus 71. That's how I got the four numbers here. And once I get the numbers, uh, the rest are very mechanical. So, let me just do it one more time. Whole maximum size, I will have 1, 2, 0, plus 0 0.010. It's not 10, it's plus 0 0.10. And the other one is minus 25, which means it's minus 0 0.25. Huh? Minus 0 0.025. For the sharp maximum size, which is minus 36, I will have 1, 2, 0, minus 0 0.036. And this will be 1, 2, 0, subtract 0 0.071. Now, minimum allowance, uh, it is the whole minimum minus shaft maximum. And this will be the whole maximum subtract shaft minimum. And this one, the value I get from there is uh, plus 0 0.011 and plus 0 0.081. In other words, this is again similar to the earlier example. Uh. Clearance fit. Now let's say I want to draw this out into the symbolic form. How do I look at it? How do I look at this thing? Let's say I have a basic size here. The basic size is 120. Now the whole is plus 10 minus 25. So I will have to draw it like that. 10 division up. plus 10, minus 25. Then I were to draw, this is the whole, this is K whole. And represented by K7. Then what about the shaft? Shaft will be right below. Minus, minus 36 means 
minus 36. Although it's not to scale, lah. I don't have the paper to draw to scale. Minus 36, minus 71. Or I rather that I did not plan properly so it doesn't look good. Lah. But it's a shaft. How I know it's a shaft? Because it's small letter F. Small letter F. So therefore, this one, you look carefully mechanically and visually, you realize that it's always a gap. This is the minimum gap. And the maximum gap is when? When this is here. Maximum gap. This is the maximum gap. This is the maximum, maximum allowance. If you were to put it now physically, this is called the minimum allowance. And this is the maximum allowance. Okay, and that will bring me to the end of the second e-lecture. I'll look forward to see you in the third e-lecture. Bye and have a nice day.